how to create a data entry form in microsoft excel hello everyone welcome to excel 10 tutorial in this quick excel tutorial i'm going to show you an interesting way of creating data entry form in microsoft excel and you don't need any user form or vba for this just a built-in feature that will allow you to insert data and you will be able to add any data you want okay let's get started <laughs> So take a look at here we have three worksheets the first one I have a lot of data entered here and the second one and the third one I will be using for this illustrations okay now I have written the header of all the fields that I want to enter here okay so you need to write that also write all the field that you need to enter data okay so i'm going to add a serial number and then a dog breed name and then percentage it obeys the command and then the repetition lower and repetition upper so i have a database here dog intelligence and i have dog breed name classification and how many percentage of the command they obey and how many repetition they need to understand new commands let's get back to the data where we are going to need a data entry from so our header are ready then I'm going to select all these and then click on insert and then I'm going to click on table okay and then select my table has header because it really has now if I click ok we just created a table here okay now this is all you need for your data entry from now we are going to access a built-in form in Excel okay now click on the file option click on more and then click on options and then click here quick access toolbar okay now if you don't want to go all this just cancel it if you hover here you will see customize quick access toolbar click here and you can see here more comments select it and you will be at the same place okay now when you are here click on this drop down and select all comments now all you need to do is scroll down and find the word form now here we have form and if I select it and then click add and click ok now the form feature has been added to our quick access toolbar okay now select anywhere in your table and then click on this form option you can see your data entry form is ready now let's insert some data here serial number and then if you press tab it will move to the next field okay remember if you press enter or down arrow your data will be entered okay breed name obey 95 percent lower reps one upper rep four now if i press enter you can see this data has been added to the table okay now the important part is here you can see the name here brightest dog this is the name of your worksheet okay now if you go another worksheet and use this form you'll understand which worksheet the data is going okay in our data entry form we have brightest dog and we are entering data to this worksheet okay now let's try another here now if I click on new you can see the data has been added here okay now close this you can close it it doesn't matter now let's click here and add a data validation here click on data and click on data validation and here I'm going to write whole number from 1 to maximum 3 and click ok so basically we added a data validation here so that we won't be able to enter data that is below 1 and more than 3 okay now click anywhere in your form and click on the data entry from and click on new let's write serial number three breed name obey 95 percent upper reps here let's write five and the lower reps we have a data validation here that will not allow to enter data above three let's write here four and if i press here you can see our data validation has stopped the data if i click here retry you can see the data has been removed and if i write here three which is inside our data validation range if i click on new and you can see our new data has been added okay that means you can add data validation to this type of form okay now now let's go to another worksheet and I need another data entry from here okay is it possible yes of course possible select the range insert table and click anywhere and then here click on the form you can see the new form has been created and here it says excellent working dogs which is the worksheet name now I have data in this range okay it's not a data table and I have already added all this data here now I need to access it from the data entry form so select the data range 
and then create a table here okay and now same way select anywhere inside your table and if you click on the form you can see all the record is here okay you can go to different data that has been entered in this table okay important part is that you can filter data and find out based on that data filter so click on criteria and if you click here and I want to find out all the dog breeds those obey more than 70% and how I can do it greater than 70% and if I click on next you can see I'm getting data that are more than 70% okay now the data has been end so all the data that has obey percentage more than 70 we can access it from here okay now here you can find delete create your form and all the field that will be dependent on your data table if you have more field here in the table it you will get that field inside your form also so this was the quickest way to create a data entry form in microsoft excel and you don't need any vba or user form or any complex task to access it okay you can use the same from for different purpose or for different worksheet this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial please share this video with your friends and don't forget to subscribe thank you thanks for watching